Hello everyone, Kevin here again, one of the two business ALs in residence. And uh, as I said in the introductory Google Docs video, I would be discussing and showing you guys a really cool program called Prezi. Now Prezi is this uh, great presentation software that you can really use to have these uh, professional looking streamlined presentations that you can use in your classes. So uh, first off, pull up Google and search Prezi. P-R-E-Z-I. Prezi, the Zooming Presentation Editor. So when you uh, search it up and click on that first link, you see up in the corner here there is a sign up thing. Now you're like, oh my gosh, like this is a lot of money. Don't worry about it. Look up here, students and teachers. Click on that. And here you see we get uh, the mid-range uh, version of the software and we get it for free. And uh, if you also want the, the really nice one, you can spend some money, but this one, the Ed you enjoy is definitely more than enough. So now I'm going to go over here to uh, my account where I'm currently logged in. And uh, let me first show you that uh, if you click on the Learn tab once you've created your own account, they've got great videos, get started, go to the next level, share your Prezi. This really teaches you how to use all the basics. They do a really good job of explaining it. And uh, I'm going to show you exactly what this looks like in case you haven't heard this before. So now this is uh, my folder of all my Prezis. And this is one that I did last year for a presentation for my one of my communication courses. So let's just load it up. And I was discussing the uh, the history of paintball or the world of paintball in, in general. And um, the great thing about Prezi is that uh, not only is it very appealing to watch and the graphics are quite nice, but um, similar to Google Docs, you can have group members edit it in the exact same way. It has the same sharing options it's set up in a very similar manner where you can share the document with people who have to have an account and they can literally edit and you can watch what they're editing. You can literally watch the work they're doing and have multiple people working on it all at the same time. They've also recently added Prezi uh, support for the iPad. So it's definitely getting really uh, really complex, but very it's very easy to use. Here you can see iPad friendly. So uh, here you see options when you load up your Prezi. There's edit, there's edit together. So that's the sharing thing I just mentioned. View together, someone can watch presentation. You can even have the presentation be watched all online. You can download and edit it offline. Save a copy and delete. So let's go to edit the Prezi. So here it uh, loads up and let me just zoom out. I have all of my different ideas surrounding my central topic and basically you can add in all these things um, using the toolbar over here. So you can insert, frame, path, all these things are explained quite well in those introductory videos I mentioned before. But uh, you know, you can click things, drag them around zoom in and uh, why don't I show you exactly what this looks like when it's in the finished products so you can kind of see the potential and this is a very basic and very quickly produced Prezi so you can only imagine how complex they might be able to get so here we are starting off and I advance to my general topic here history I zoom in as I go from point to point I'm discussing uh, the information that uh, came from my research and uh, here I can show you in a second you can actually embed videos They'll play automatically. As you can hear, there's sound. The videos that you can embed can be much higher quality. It just so happened that this particular video wasn't the best quality, but uh, the sky really is the limit. Prezi's, um, your account as a student with that mid-range, you have 500 megabytes of, uh, of online storage, which means the total of your Prezi's altogether, you can have files that equal 500 megs. So if this particular video is a 10 megabyte file, that's 10 out of my 500 that is being used up in addition to all the information in the presentation itself. So zooming right in, you can zoom right out, change uh, which angle you're looking at things. It's really quite cool. Now I won't put you through the whole thing. Let's hit escape. And uh, it's pretty neat. And say, uh, say you had another idea, you simply double click, type something, hi. Hit OK. And there's, there's tons of options. It's really uh, something you need to sit down, poke around with for a little bit, and um, you know, again, once again, those, those videos that are very important, those introductory videos, but uh, no more than half an hour and you can be making your own Prezi, it'll look real nice, and you can even have people send your information, send their information to you, you can throw it together by yourself, or have everyone make their own account and work on it all together at the same time. Uh, one thing that would be ideal though is if you maybe all had Skype accounts, that way you could have a voice chat and uh, discuss what you're doing on top of 
seeing what each other's doing because really there's no way to communicate other than uh, you know the, the phone or whatever. So that's another thing to consider. But uh, all in all, really great software and very worthwhile to check out. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section down below. See you later.